shows in your downward gaze that indicate you are triplets in them. Wow, observe them. My apologies. We elves may have heightened speed, agility, strength, and attractiveness. You're also humble to boot. But we're lacking in emotional awareness. What, are you like a robot or something? No, we're above emotions. It's a human trait. Well, color me envious just right about now. What troubles you? Well, I joined this adventure to get to know Tilly, to help her, but I don't think she needs me at all. Well, she is a 20th level paladin. We travel with her before we often require her help. Wow, Elf, you're really bad at giving advice. I apologize. Let's get back to the group, shall we? You return back to your party, who are all waiting for you at the mountain of, at the foot of the mountain of steepness. Before you can move forward, you spy something ahead of you. It's large, cube-shaped, and gelatinous. We are all waiting for you at the foot of the mountain of steepness. But before you can move forward, you spy something ahead of you. It's large, cube-shaped, and gelatinous. Ew! What is that? Oh, that might be my friend's boss number one. The gelatinous cube. It is I, the great big Steve and Pony Pajello Mold. What? Did you make a Jello Mold monster in this game? What? No. You actually did? That was correct, love. You made a big cube of the monster. So, hold up, that thing isn't edible? No. Dang, now I got the munchies. Why'd you make a flesh eating Jello Mold? I don't know. Tilly? Maybe because it's your favorite food? I thought you liked it too. No, I just ate it because mom and dad always made it. Just like they do everything for you. What? They never have time for you because they're too focused on you. That's not fair, Tilly, and you know it. I thought you were here to get to know me and save my soul. I guess you didn't mean it. Push over, guys. We lost. Tilly! Wait. Why? So I can watch you, mom, dad all live together and forget all about me? I would never forget about you. You did when I was there. Oh, snap. She went there. So are we giving up or what? Fine, whatever. So are we going to kill it or not? Fine, let's kill it. Really? Really. You hear that? We're gonna kill you! Oh, I don't think boss number one is actually a gelatinous cube. It's a shapeshifter. A doppelganger, to be exact. So we'll kill it, sis. Yeah. Boss by number one, Agnes versus the doppelganger. It's a boss fight, not supposed to be fair. Seriously? Are you guys not gonna help? I mean, it's so no, you kind of have to put up my shoes. Really cool. You guys really stink. Ah! Uh, 
congratulations on defeating the bugbears. Agnes levels up. So just Agnes and Tilius the Paladin ventured forth into the dark dwellings of the truly evil and quite large in stature, Ogus the Overlord of the Underworld, and searched for the lost soul of athletes. But what they found deep in that cave was not what they were expecting in the least bit. Besides, the great Paladin Tilius, healer of the wounded defender of lights, I have come here to do. I'm not going to fight you. He's not going to fight us? I've come here to battle. I know what you came here to do, and I'm telling you, I'm busy. This is the Overlord of the Underworld? Former Overlord of the Underworld, and then you quit. You quit? You can't quit. What are you talking about? I can't quit. You know how annoying it is to always get attacked by adventurers all day and night? It is, it is I, the great lady Steve, that have come in and I have come to it's all yours. <laughs> well, I mean, all I to do. Awesome. So, what would you like? Treasure, jewels, some uh, cheese whiz? Good. I wish to be sold. Which one? Mine. What? You're in your office. I want my soul back. Well, this is a bit awkward. Wait, you're the lost soul of Athens? Shh. Yeah, I sort of lost your lost soul. How is that possible? Yeah, I sort of traded it in for this cool smart TV from Neo. Tiamat. So you just gave my soul to the Tiamat? Those have streaming services. This isn't good, is it? No, not good at all.
I don't know. It wasn't addressed to me. Do you want it? Have a good day. Wait. Yeah? I, uh, I didn't know Tilly. I mean, we were close. She was my girlfriend, I think. But I don't think she was enough. And other people knew too. That's why she moved away. She was like a big boy for no reason she is. Anyways, you're not crazy. Tilly was my first boss. I'm very sure I was going to do it. I thought you might want to know that. Thank you for telling me. And I can Don't worry, Lily. I won't tell anyone. Thank you. Okay, Jack, I get it. Let's do this. <laughs>